The Pokemon NASCAR series continues World Tour 23 with the first of three races in Canada. We start right here in Canadian Tire Motorsports Park. The pole setter today is the number 38 Kent Shearer. Cars are going to roll off the track. John Andrews, by the way, shows the front row. And our last winner from Rocky Hill UK, Chris Dodd, starts in the back of the Wow. So, 16 laps here at Canadian Tire, most sport, by the way. And it's a tough course for these guys, so it'll be very interesting to see how these guys will start off the three race tour in Canada. We have this, Circuit Jill Velenev in Montreal and 349 in British Columbia. This is in Ontario, by the way, so. The green flag will be out here in Canadian Tire. Wow, Shear got a really bad jump, and John Andrews is off to the lead. Looks like Shear gonna have to play catch up. Shear and um, Andrews have win. Miles Green, the only one in the top five, but Dalton have a win. Super Sauron, the king. Here they come. Sometimes they spin on the kink. Wow, they're clean this time. Awesome. I decided to go with a different Canadian tire so that the kink spin doesn't happen. Because when the newest one I have, I've raced in a couple seasons, had the kink. Everyone kept spinning on it, even the leader and the even the leaders, and it really wasn't making things fun. So I'm gonna go with this track. Uh, for uh, this one. So we'll see how it goes. And right now, clean and green so far in the first lap as John Andrews pulls away. Benjamin Miles now up to second. Cooper Sauron has moved to third. And a battle for fourth place. We have a caution though. It's holding Gluba in the number 44 with a crash. Yep, he got into the grass and hits the barriers, and he just couldn't move the car. Just lost control there. That's going to pretty much ruin John Andrews' lead. But you know, it was gonna, he was going to pull away anyway, so probably was a benefit for the drivers in the back. No problem so far. Trying to close in for this is for the third spot. Going down low. Ooh, look at Sauron with a good block. Sauron trying to block the 21. Interesting battle for the lead here. Bumper to bumper, uphill. And he hang on. Ooh, looks real loose, and he does hang on. Shear gets the position in fourth place. We're under caution, first time. And John Andrews going to lead us back to the green flag here on lap five. Green. And Tony Green's pitting be just before the green waves. And Benjamin Miles gets by for the lead. Tony Green has a problem. He was running eight. Gordon's off the road and he's scraping the wall for whatever reason. But Benjamin Miles got a good jump somehow. Let's see what happened. How did he do that? There you see Miles. Oh, Gordon got turned. He got turned on a pit road and no caution. How did that not bring a yellow? He was running 7th. Oh, wow. Contact under yellow. And the walls. You can go through them. <laughs> the pit wall there on the left. On their left. You can go through them. How weird is that? Wow. The other track didn't have this glitch, but this one does. Oh, man. That's ugly, but no caution. I don't think the pace even saw what happened with the back. This is 
how Benjamin Wild got that lead away from the 17. Going into the kink right now. And it's clean and green so far. And Green's off pit road, and he's going to have some words with Gordon if he catches up to him. I can imagine. And now two front row cars running top five. Kept here and ain't Troxel. And now Troxel's getting a battle with Ian Siegel. No contact. Avoids the barriers there. Oh no! Sheer and Trunksel spins! Oh, he can't get back up! Johnny Garner Rex and a caution's out. We had another crash. Anthony Lopez crashed out. Contact with Leia. Right here. Oh, that's probably what brought the yellow first. It did. For a Troxel's incident, they won't race it back. They're gonna go. They're, they're not gonna race it back. Oh, but a tough break for Abe Troxel was running in the top five until this until disaster struck. What a shame. We're gonna go back to green here on lap eight. Any incidents? Whoa, Green was trying to do it again. He just made through Gordon. Angry at Gordon for the wreck before, and now the three is out of the race. Hey, now the back to see how the three retired. Oh, did he get damage from the wreck? We're gonna assume he got damage from the wreck. Yeah, I'm just gonna assume he got damage from the wreck. Oh, and Leia, by the way, the others retired. Miles pulls away. Cooper Sauron gets second. Gluva, Walker, Lopez, um, Troxel, and Skinner are out of the race. And Cooper Sauron looks slow. Can he go for the lead? Downhill. Here they go. The hills are coming up. Ooh, Lopez. Look at this. Sauron and Miles trying to bump bumpers here and looks like it's Miles getting it but no nope, we stay green and John Andrews pitting and the six gets by Sauron leads so far clean and the 78 Seagulls out pair road John Andrews on pair road Weird. We'll see if Miles will look low and look for another chance to pass uphill. A lot of uphill and downhill corners, by the way, for this track. That's what makes it challenging for these cars sometimes. They got to go up and down. Here comes the kink. Miles looks low. Gets him in the kink. He takes the lead again. Miles goes by the six of Siron to retake the lead. Good race so far. Third place is Dylan Thoreau. Will Thoreau have a chance? And now fourth, Kermika Jansen. And only O'Bell, but down the S's. And there they go. Ooh, bumper to bumper again. Really close. They got it. Jansen has it. By the way, Siren's the only one in the top five that doesn't have a win this season, so Siren really needs this. But he's getting ch challenged by Dylan Thoreau for second. This could be the chance Miles needs to get his third win this season. Maybe Superman could win a title after all. There's seven to go in Canada and here in, um, in CTMP. Here's the kink. This is where Miles got through the six. Widen the gap a little bit down the kink. That's probably his best line on the whole track. So we'll just see if uh, Miles can hold on for a little longer. 
Rocco Twyman is now all the way up in fifth. Wow, all the way up in fifth. Now we have six to go. Six to go here for the 48. Still trying to hang on to the lead. Bronco Twyman is up to fifth place. A great run for him. Kev Shear is running eighth. Grayson Acevedo, 19th. Richardson is 10th. A little dark there by the sixth team. And Jazz unable to survive. Looks as though the 6 has closed the gap a little bit on the 48. Not quite there yet. There, here comes the king. And Miles does it again. He is really good on the king. And he's showing it. Oh, look at Balvin. Looks for 5th place. This is for 5th place. Going downhill, can Balvin get the 43? He might get him here, he will get him here. Balvin gets by, 43. Five to go. Miles has extended the gap to one second. He's gone even faster than before could be the day Miles again gets his third win this season. That would be big for the team. Definitely already locked in the chase, but another win would be nice for the 48 who had Batman, the 88, win the last race. But having Batman Superman win on back-to-back -back races would be something. We had a battle with Rogers and Billy Bishop, but now a battle with Elijah Gordon and Kyle Collins. Oh, Twyman was really slow on the corner. Holds up back of the pack, and now it's going to set up a really tight matchup with Jared Lewis and Kev Shearer on the bumper. Oh, boy. Four laps to go. Looks like Cooper might have actually, Cooper actually, believe it or not, Cooper saw on actually um, closed in a little bit on the 48. And some drivers are pitting. You gotta wonder if pit stops might play in a factor here today. We'll see if this will be decided on fuel mileage, if miles can make it. Uh, I have not seen the leaders pit today from what I've, from, well, where I'm standing at have not seen these leaders pit. So it'll be interesting if they decide to come to pit road and possibly um, set up a finish here. So Miles has got to be thinking of at least trying to save fuel. Now Kamika Jazz wants third place from down the road. Here she comes. Can she get third? Trying to get through. No pit stop yet for these drivers. Jazzin, too high. Hits the wall. Wow, three to go and that's the race. Just like that. Kamika Jazzin was too high and the race is over with three to go under caution. Wow, Kamika Jazzin Rex. Trying to get by Thoreau for third. Steer the car, hits the wall, that's it. That's the race, just like that. Now we'll see if Miles stays out. So far he does. And it's just safe to say that Benjamin Miles is going to win again. And he does. Benjamin Miles wins for the third time this season at Canadian Tire Motorsports Park. Superman has won for the third time this season. Man, that car is lucky.
Hedrick has won for the second race in a row. Miles does it here in Canadian Tire. He was dominant in this track. Nobody could stop him all day. Here's how the rest of the field finished, by the way. Just having his miles, by the way, having the season of his lifetime. Three wins this season, the first three-time winner of the season. And we'll see you guys our next race at, Kine at Circuit Jill Villeneuve in Montreal. Boy, would that be a good race to, to watch. We'll see you in Montreal.